Arthur Boyd's long career produced a huge number of beautiful paintings and the range of his work carries from, let's say, the naturalistic to the imaginative. We know that in some cases his paintings are rich in iconographic meaning, they're filled with uh, figures from the Old Testament and personal his personal life and from from incidents from the from the news and from from everywhere he was a omnivorous absorber of uh, concepts he's using a number of stock themes which he devised at a fairly early stage in his career landscape with potty painted in 1948 is one of the paintings of a series called the hunter the hunter is one of the themes that boyd used to talk about himself. He was an independent spirit and he saw it as his role in, the, in his family as a provider, but also as a, a solitary male. It's his job to provide and to do so by going out on his own and doing things which require solitude, that is working in the studio. Landscape with Potty shows uh, the side of a hill, beautifully painted using tempera. Boyd's um, painting technique in the 40s was influenced strongly by his interest in European old master painting. And, and this painting, Landscape with Potty, uh, the side of the hill, you can see how each blade of grass is clearly delineated and has the most extraordinary, delicate softness and texture. So the painting is a, quite a beautiful um, visual uh, feast. In the background on the left hand side behind the tree you can see the tiny figure of the hunter who's sort of walking off into the distance with his gun slung over his shoulder. They're very mysterious paintings uh, on one level and very enigmatic and very uh, evocative but at the same time they're very beautiful and this particular painting from this period from 48 when Boyd was using this wonderful technique, um, it's a wonderful example of, the, of this technique, uh, are some of the best landscape paintings that Boyd did.